basically you're asking how to reach a deeper state of sleep where you're not still being disturbed by some of the the waking thoughts that that occupy your mind sometimes right is, is that more or less the question um my answer would be that the reason you're not reaching that deeper level of sleep sometimes is that you're not completely turning your body off so some your brain is probably the, probably more active during that time right so i think that's why you know in a slightly deeper stage of sleep you start to dream but that's your brain is still sometimes functioning enough to to be putting imagery into your mind um how can you reach a deeper state of sleep i would suggest trying to meditate before you go to bed maybe try that breathing technique a little bit and try and meditate and just try to try to put down you know when i say ego and sense of i meant i mean literally not like you have a big ego and you're you have a lot of pride about yourself i i mean literally your sense of self so try to put down your thoughts your sense of self try to let that go as much as you can before you go to sleep and i think that will help you reach that state it's i think it will it might take some practice to get it to work consistently but i don't know um you can you can definitely meditate lying down usually i suggest laying on your back uh and just relaxing closing your eyes and try to meditate in that position similar to you know what we did in class using the mantra maybe start with the breathing especially if you have if your mind is racing about things that happened during the day and first just try to calm down your body with the breathing and then try to clear your mind with the meditation and i would say give that a try if you fall asleep in that state you should fall right into like a sleeping meditation and i think that will take you right into that deep state of sleep um that's the the best advice i can give you but i think keep trying it if it doesn't work the first time you know just keep giving it a try see see if it works try it for a few nights before you give up on it if it's not working um yeah that's a that's a tough one though it's hard to easier said than done right to turn your mind off or to turn your brain off i think that's really where the the interference is coming uh overactive brain and thinking so i i would suggest just um trying that meditation technique so is there a way to train your mind while you're sleeping that will enhance your experiences while you're living i would uh i would generally defer to what i said before you know you can turn your sleep into meditation if you tell yourself you you practice just like i suggested meditating prior to going to sleep and then telling yourself that you're going to meditate in your sleep so planting that seed i feel like i get that some nights and i think it's not only from doing that technique of meditating while sleeping but also trying to have a regular meditation routine you know do sitting meditation but also try to turn your actions into your meditation and focus always what you're doing moment by moment and then when you get good at doing that in your waking hours you can also apply that to your sleeping hours i don't think it's like you flick a switch and all of a sudden it works it didn't happen like that for me but just from spending many many hours a day meditating and trying to fo- keep focused on what i'm doing you get better and better at making more of your day a meditation and of course there's always things that are going to come up that derail you from the path but if you have this routine and this mindset of returning to that practice then it won't derail you as long 
and then then I think your your sleep will also become more restful and also a form of meditation and I think if you're waking up and your mind is clear that's the days you probably feel really good right and you want to try and have every moment kind of turn into that experience where yeah maybe something really frustrating comes up and you're aggravated but then you have just you remember your mantra in that moment like whatever whatever it is and you remember i'm just gonna like focus my mind for the next minute even if you have to just take a minute out of your day to sit clear your mind and then try to get back into the same thing where you're staying focused on whatever is in front of you and not letting whatever just happens poison the moment basically but i think it's a process you you start from zero where most of your day is just being controlled by your thoughts and you try and whittle that down so that more of more of your day is being spent in a meditative state and then keep trying to push that into your sleep as well because that's the root of your question but i think if if you meditated all day you're going to go to sleep with a clear mind right so then that just will go right into a more restful sleep so that that would be my advice it's i wish i had a, an easier answer but um i think that that has been my experience um and has led to more restful nights <laughs>